welcome back to my channel and welcome back to The Sims in Bloom part 16. So it is nearly 10am this morning in the Bloom household. Everybody has woken up pretty late this morning. Jaden is just cooking Daisy and himself at some breakfast. It looks like they're having some eggs on toast this morning. And Daisy is sitting here with the birthday boy in today's episode. Leifer is going to be aging up into a child. He's just having pancakes for breakfast this morning that were left over from yesterday. Looks like the food is ready so let's get Daisy to come and grab a serving as well. It looks like Jaden did a great job of making today's breakfast. Jaden has actually finished his breakfast so I'm going to go ahead and get him to give Leif a bubble bath since he does need to get his hygiene up. So we will give him a bath and get him ready for his birthday today. It is also boxing day today. It's the day after Winterfest and also in this episode we are going to be celebrating New Year's Eve too. So whilst Leif is having a bath I'm going to get Daisy to make him a cake. Luckily we do actually have the ingredients so we're gonna make him a chocolate cake for his birthday. The weather is actually really really nice today. It is starting to warm up a little bit now too which is great. It is super sunny and it is still snowy but it's not freezing which is great. Leif is also wearing my favourite outfit of his today. The outfit with the little bear hat and his overalls. He looks super cute. I can't believe he's gonna be aging up into a child. I'm really really looking forward to him aging up though. Daisy has just finished the cake so we are going to get Leif to blow out the candles on that very soon. So let's get Daisy to quickly add some birthday candles but before we do age up Leif we do need to do something very very quickly. First let's get Daisy to get changed. But Daisy has actually been feeling very nauseous so I am actually going to get her to come in here and take a pregnancy test. Daisy and Jaden have been trying for another baby so let's see if Daisy is pregnant. This is a very exciting way to start off the episode but we do need to see if she's going to be having another baby or not and it looks like she is pregnant so she's going to go ahead and she's going to tell Jaden her bump has already started to show already. Look how big that bump is already. So it looks like Daisy is off to go and find Jaden upstairs. He's actually sitting in here. It looks like he was talking to Leigh but Daisy's gonna go ahead and tell Jaden that they're expecting another baby and we're also gonna have to tell Leif that he's also gonna be expecting a sibling on the way too. So we are gonna tell Leif once he ages up I think it is better to tell him as a child so he's gonna understand a little bit more what that means. So let's get Jaden to come on over here and stand over here and then we will get Daisy to go ahead and help blow out candles and we will help Leif blow out the birthday candles. Okay, here we go. Leif is blowing out the candles and Jaden walks straight in the way. But here we go. Leif is going to age up. I cannot wait to see what he's going to look like as a child. I feel like his features are definitely going to start to show more and I wonder if he's going to look more like Daisy or Jaden. Here we go. He's aging up and here he is as a child. So Leif has aged up with level 2 motor, social and creativity and he's aged up with level 1 mental skill. So the trait that I'm going to give Leif is a cat lover. Since for now I'm going to go with that he is going to be the heir for the next gen. However obviously Daisy is now pregnant and that child could be the next heir of gen 2. But for now I'm going to give Leif just the cat lover trait since that is one of the traits for the next gen. So I'm going to give him this trait and for his aspiration I think for now I'm just going to give him the social butterfly aspiration. I'm not quite sure what aspiration to give Leif. I might actually look into finding a mod that gives more aspirations for children. I feel like I have had a mod like that before so I'm gonna see if I can find a mod so that we can have a few more aspirations for kids because there's only four and I feel like that isn't a lot at all. But they are gonna be Leif's traits and aspiration for now. So let's go ahead and we will click done and here he is aged up. So I'm gonna give him a quick makeover in Creator Sim and then we will see him once he has had his 
Lay's full makeover. So I have gone ahead and given Lay for a makeover. So I will quickly show you some of his outfits. So these are Lay's everyday outfits. I've mainly gone for green for majority of his outfits. This is his formal wear. This is his athletic wear, which actually looks super comfy by the way. <laughs> this is his sleepwear, his party wear, his swimwear. Then these are his hot weather outfits. And then these are his cold weather outfits. So as you can see, I mainly went for greens, but I think his outfits are super cute. So I have also given Leif's room a makeover. So I've mainly gone for green colours in his room. And I gave him a bunk bed since I never really seem to use these a lot. So I have given him one of the bunk beds from Dream Home Decorator. He also has a cabinet under here with a cute little piggy bank on and also as well it has some cds from his favorite music artist i guess which looks like it is at the flower bunny <laughs> i also gave him a few more musical things around his room since i remembered as a toddler he actually really enjoyed music so i wanted to bring that into his childhood as well so i've given him a stereo in his room and i've given him lots of space so then he can dance around as well and also i've given him these posters too he has has a desk area where he can just do some crafts and also some writing. I also kept these fairy lights from when he was a toddler too. I think that he really liked them so he decided to keep them in his room. I've also put here the science table that he got for Christmas and it was perfect for this space too and then we just have some more wall decorations and we have a few plants over here too. So that is basically Leif's bedroom. Soon we are also going to have to turn this room into baby number two's room. At the moment it is a spare room but soon it will be turning into the baby's room since Daisy will probably be having the baby next episode maybe around this day here so I'm super excited we will be finding out the gender of the baby next episode too but for now we are gonna play with Leif he is now a child I'm so glad that he has aged up looks like he actually wants to do his homework so he can do that in a second but first off I'm actually gonna get him and Daisy to sit here and also Jaden's gonna join in as well and we are gonna get Daisy to tell Leif that she's pregnant which means that he's gonna have a sibling so let's share the big news with Leif and see if he's gonna be excited Daisy's gonna say she's pregnant which means he's gonna have a brother or a sister and he looks really excited about it so that is great let's get Daisy to help Leif with his homework since it's his first time doing his homework and he's probably gonna need a bit of help and he's already got one skill to level two so his grades are gonna hopefully go up pretty quickly also let me know what you think do you think that Leif looks more like a Daisy or more like Jaden I think he looks so much like Daisy in my opinion so Leif has now finished his homework and he is in need of some fun so I'm gonna get him to come up here looks like he actually wants to play with the science table so I'm gonna get him to do that I was gonna get him to come to his room anyways and I'm gonna get Daisy to quickly come up here and tend to her garden so let's come and feed and pet our cow plant my cow plant is still bugged out i was gonna plant these things here however it is nearly spring now so i think i'm just gonna sell them or actually instead of selling them we could keep them and put them in our fridge for food so i think i'm gonna do that instead daisy has just reached level 9 of the gardening skill oh my gosh she is so close to level 10 ricky also just texted leif and said congratulations on your recent birthday we are going to be seeing them tomorrow because it's new year's eve so leif will get to see his grandparents as a child which i'm glad about because it means they're going to be able to socialize a bit more which is going to be nice it looks like Jaden and leif are up here using leif's science kit he looks like he's having a lot of fun with it though it is getting pretty late now though so i'm gonna get everyone to come on over to the kitchen and grab some dinner we're just having a leftover winterfest dinner from yesterday since it needs eating up it's great to have a meal all together and Leif joining in as well. I'm so glad that he's now aged up into a child. And tomorrow he's going to be celebrating his first event as a child as well, which is going to be New Year's Eve. I'm super excited. We're going to be bringing in the new year. I cannot believe that it has already been technically a year in Sims game that we've been playing this save for. We're going to be rolling around back to spring again where we started this Let's Play. And I'm really looking forward to seeing the spring since I feel like it's been very snowy for a very long 
long time now but I think tomorrow we should definitely take advantage of the last bits of the snow and maybe Leif can play outside for a bit. So I'm gonna get everyone to start getting ready to head to sleep. Look who is also up here in Leif's room. We might have to get a bed for Kira up here. It looks like he likes hanging out in here. <laughs> so I'm going to get Daisy to say a good night to Leif and put him to bed. So Leif is going to crawl on up to bed into his bunk bed. And we will see everybody in the morning to celebrate New Year's Eve. Good morning everybody and happy New Year's Eve. It is the last day of winter today and it is quite a cloudy day today as well. It is currently half six in the morning and Leif is already awake and up. I was just gonna kind of see where he was gonna go. Oh looks like he's off to do something now. Looks like he's gonna actually go and watch Super Kids on TV. Daisy has also just woken up and she's actually come to give Leif a hug which is super super cute. So she's just come to say good morning to Leif and also happy new year's eve as well. He's probably talking about how excited he is for today and that he's gonna stay up until midnight and it also looks like somebody is sick and Oliver has got a red nose so we're gonna have to take him to the vet today so we get Jaden to get ready to take Oliver to the vet maybe Leif can come along with us too so let's go ahead and we will get Leif to get ready as well and wrap up in a coat since it's still pretty cold outside Daisy's gonna stay here in the warm and while we're gone I'm gonna get her to get her logic skill up because because she does need to do that for her career and then let's go ahead and we will take Oliver to the vet clinic poor Oliver I feel like he's always getting sick he was only sick a couple of parts ago here we are we have arrived on over at the vet clinic so I'm gonna get Jaden to go ahead and sign Oliver in to cure his sickness and Leif has decided that he actually doesn't want to go inside the vet clinic because on the way here he spotted a ice skating rink near the park area so he's going to go play on that instead and Jaden is going to sit on over here with Oliver and wait until he can be seen. Leif is also pretty hungry so he did actually ask his dad if he could grab something from the stall too. So his dad gave him some money and I can imagine Leif being a child he's probably going to pick a chocolate chip cookie because I mean we're a kid would not pick the chocolate chip cookie <laughs> so he's just gonna quickly hop off of the ice skating rink and he's gonna come over here and grab a cookie and then he's probably gonna head straight back on here's Leif enjoying his cookie he looks like he's having a great time he's finished that now so we get him to come on back over to the skating rink and let's see how well he can do the lake is all frozen over and it looks so so pretty once the lake is no longer frozen I can imagine Jaden would probably want to come on over here and do a bit of fishing with his dad and it looks like Oliver has overheated sniffer so we're gonna give him some of the expensive treatments so that we can cure him straight away. Leif's skating around the ice rink he looks like he's doing a good job he hasn't fallen over yet which is good. There's a man catching up behind him though he needs to speed up. I feel like he's probably panicking like I'm gonna get run over. <laughs> so I just got Jaden to send home Oliver and we're gonna head on over here and see what Leif is up to. Oh, it looks like Jaden is actually just watching Leif skate around the ice rink. He looks really happy. He's just watching Leif go round. But it is getting pretty late. We've been here for quite a few hours now. So I am going to get these two to head on home. And I think maybe we should hang out all in the garden and maybe build a snow pal. Have a snowball fight and make the most of the snow before it does leave. These guys have just gotten home. And look who is at the door. Ricky is at the door. Let's give him a hug. Leif's also gonna spin his noise maker maybe that's what his granddad brought him over for later on let's maybe get him to come on over here and build a snow pal with ricky i think that will be really sweet if he can hang out with his granddad for a bit and let's get daisy and Jaden to build a snow pal right next to them as well apparently we can't build a snow pal i think my mcc might actually be broken i'm not too sure what's going on i can't do any activities in the snow okay it's okay snowball fighting is working i think i've had this glitch before with mc
NCC. But these guys are having a snowball fight and taking advantage of the snow before it leaves. It will probably start melting tomorrow. But this is such a sweet family moment. Look at Leif teasing everybody. Also, look how pregnant Daisy is already. I cannot believe how big her bump is. She's only been pregnant for a day. It's getting pretty late, so I think in a bit we will grab some dinner. Maybe we can order some takeaway since it is New Year's Eve. And then we will all get ready to celebrate and watch the New Year's TV as well. And we're going to invite around Jaden's parents too. Ricky is somewhere around here. He was going to hang out with us and then he just disappeared. So I'm not sure where he went. Oh my gosh, Jaden just hit Daisy in the face and she landed on the floor. Jaden, you need to be careful. Your fiance is pregnant right now. That's karma. <laughs> also, I just remembered that we do actually need to make resolutions because it is New Year's Eve. So I think we will go ahead and get these guys to make resolutions. So let's get Daisy to... I think maybe we should either do raise a skill or get promoted. So maybe we should do raise a skill because we need to raise our logic skill before we get promoted. So let's get Daisy to pick that resolution and hopefully we will raise our logic skill. So we're going to get her to pick that resolution and then let's get Jaden to pick one too. I'm not really sure what aspiration I want him to do because I'm pretty sure he actually can't get promoted. So maybe we should just get him to also raise the skill and he can try and raise his fishing skill. And then let's get Leif to make a resolution too. Maybe we can get him to become a better student. He did do his homework earlier, straight away after he aged up. So maybe he really, really wants to get his grades up in school. That's what he's working towards at the moment. It also looks like everybody is getting pretty hungry. So we'll get everyone to head inside and we can grab some food in a second. Oh no, what has happened in this kitchen? I think someone might have been eating the dirty food in the pet bowl and it was making them sick. I'm so sorry, that was are for okay let's go ahead and we'll order a delivery let's order a food delivery we don't have to get pizza there is so many other things we can get so maybe we can have a look at other things to get to we could order some fish and chips that could be a pretty good meal to get i think maybe we should order some fish and chips that's a pretty good takeout meal to grab so let's get Jaden to order that and i'm just getting daisy to clean this up this is our four i think we might have given the cat some moldy cat food Look who has also arrived. Let's go ahead and we will run on over to Madsen and share our New Year's Eve excitement. And also we talk about our birthday too. Our food has also arrived, so let's come and grab that. Here we go, we have the fish and chips. So let's go ahead and we will get everybody to grab a serving all together. And we will eat this up before we start watching the New Year's Eve TV and starting the celebrations. Looks like Leif and Madsen have actually decided to sit up here together. So let's have a chat with her. Maybe we can share our resolution with her and also enthuse about cats a bit too. He has also just completed a milestone in his aspiration as well. These two don't actually know each other that well so we will have to get their relationship up and all the adults are over here having a chat and we actually need to get Daisy to share the fact that she is pregnant. So let's go ahead and we will share the big news with Ricky and Shirley. Leif has learned the following traits about Madsen that she is a music lover. So maybe these two can talk about music a little bit. I definitely think that Leif's interest in music will increase as he gets older since he already really really shows an interest in music as it is now and he definitely did as a toddler too. So everyone is already hanging out in the kitchen watching the New Year's Eve TV all together. So let's get Daisy to join in and also Jaden and Leif too. Everybody is starting to get up because it's getting pretty close to midnight so everyone's getting up and getting ready to count down in front of the TV. I actually love this interaction about the sims i think it's super cool i love that they actually stand in front of the tv and count down okay it's nearly time it's nearly midnight we're getting really close looks like they already started counting okay here we go we're gonna count down with them so here we go 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 happy new year every oh look at madison and Leif giving each other a hug 
that was super super sweet looks like daisy is straight off to bed she's super tired and it looks like leif is off to give his grandma a hug too he's also super tired too so he's probably gonna head on up to bed as well everybody headed on home because i think everyone was super tired but it's been a great new year's eve we managed to count down to midnight and it is now at the beginning of a brand new sims year that i think is going to be a lot of fun and a lot of fun things that are going to be happening first to start off with daisy's probably going to be giving birth to their second child in the next part which is going to be really exciting and you guys are also going to be finding out the gender of the baby too i'm going to be honest i have checked the gender of the baby for this baby but you guys still do not know yet so let me know what you think in the comments are you team boy or are you team a girl i would be interested to know however i'm gonna go ahead and leave this episode right here i hope that you did enjoy it today's episode has been very eventful and super fun leif aged up into a child he looks so much like daisy in my opinion let me know what you think he does have Jaden's hair color though but i think he looks a lot like daisy with his features we celebrated new year's eve too and we found out that daisy was pregnant daisy's pregnancy has gone by so so fast but they are only pregnant for three days in the sims so i guess that's why but i do hope that you enjoyed today's episode i hope that you have a great rest of your day and i will see you again very very soon bye